If you're looking at the skyline of Lower Manhattan, you can't miss this building. It's 56 Leonard Street, designed by the Swiss architects Herzog and Miron, with Goldstein Hill and West architects. It's an apartment tower of 60 floors in the Tribeca neighborhood, with 145 units. Some people call it the Jenga Tower because of the offsets of the floors. The developer bought the site in 2006, including air rights from adjacent sites, but the recession delayed the project for several years. It was finally completed in 2017. The tower is 831 feet tall with a height to width ratio of 1 to 10.5, joining a number of new towers that have been built recently in New York. The architects explained that they felt that other towers were anonymous and repetitive so they conceived of the design as a stack of individual homes developed from the inside out. The lower portion of the tower conforms more closely to the street, while the top staggers from side to side. There are seven zones of the tower with two mechanical equipment zones that have additional structural bracing. The expressive top of the tower appears to be carefully balanced with substantial terraces. The concrete floor slabs and beams are thickened to support the cantilever terraces. A sculpture by Anish Kapoor next to the lobby is planned to squeeze in between the floors and the sidewalk, but it hasn't been installed yet. You don't have to go far to find food or drink. Right across the street, in fact, is Two Hands, a cafe that takes inspiration from Australia's culinary scene. Come for breakfast or lunch, coffee or a beer. The neighborhood has so many places, including the Odeon nearby, a landmark from 1980 that's still around. Even if you don't make it to Tribeca to see 56 Leonard up close, look for this new and unique building from different angles on the skyline.